are dealing with communities who don't know how to access resources within philanthropy, who know what they need in their communities but have no idea that there's money out there to be had. know that if a woman's life changes, the life of her family changes and ultimately the life of her community changes. We're a foundation that makes grants. We also have learned over the years that a grant is often not enough. That when an organization is a stronger organization, uh, have better uh, organizational development skills, better fundraising, stronger boards, they actually have a greater impact. And so we also now do a lot of work to help strengthen organizations. We know the statistics that if you're an organization run by a woman of color, you are least likely to be funded. The Women's Foundation knows that and really puts their financial support where their heart and their politics are. Unless we could really move the policies and the systems that keep women coming into shelters, keep women underemployed and in lower wage jobs, really we're not going to improve the economic futures of women and their families. You know, I never saw my mother vote. I didn't see the community organizing, standing up for their rights. And so you see communities like mine, marginalized and disenfranchised, and that's just the way it's always been. When you recognize the, the power the influence, the breadth and scope of work of the state legislature, it's really critical that it mirrors the population that we're supposed to represent. We really believe that change is driven by those most impacted by the problem. And throughout our history, we've really been able to, and fortunate to be able to identify really strong leaders that have catalyzed lots of change in the state of California. The Women's Foundation is able to provide yearly trainings which really allow you, whether you're staff, whether you're a volunteer, whether you're a woman from the community, to be trained on the policy process on behalf of your organization. The Women's Policy Institute is a 12-month intensive training program to teach grassroots women from California how to participate in the policy process. The WPI is uh, really about getting women who are not traditionally going to be exposed to the legislative process more involved. The success of the Women's Policy Institute has really been one of my biggest surprises in my career. These women have been able to move so much policy. When you give a woman a voice and you, you give her the, uh, the knowledge of her own power, that she has control over her life, her children's life, she can control her community, that's giving somebody freedom. In terms of how we see change happening, people have to come together to make it happen. I give to causes that support women and girls because when women are supported, they turn around and immediately support their families. Women bring a unique skill set and life experience to any public policy discussion and negotiation. Without the Women's Foundation, that voice would be missing.